Travelers landing or transiting through the Jomo Kenyatta International Airport will begin to enjoy land and live luggage services following the launch of Airport Mtani, a luggage handling service under Hala Nairobi, a logistic company based in JKIA. Mtani. Official launch. Another round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. We appreciate that. Congratulations, Airport Mtani. Congratulations. Speaking during the colorful launch on Thursday, Airport Mtani's Operation Director, Humphrey Mbogo, said the service will ease pressure on a busy JKIA. We are a baggage facilitation company for all passengers who come to the airport seeking baggage facilitation. We are there at the land side to assist our passengers uh, have a safe and um, good flight without the hassles of baggage. We have a plan to sell convenience to our passengers and the airport community has come in big numbers to support us because luggage convenience is one thing that's in the in thing now in most of the airports and Jomo Kenyatta International Airport will also be one of those airports that have luggage convenience to their passengers. Also in attendance was Jomo Kenyatta International Airport's General Manager, Selena Gore, who welcomed this noble idea by stating that the concept will revolutionize passengers' experience at JKIA. The growing popularity in terms of luggage delivery services can be attributed to the increasing complexity and time constraints of the passengers who are traveling. This is where luggage delivered right to your doorstep makes sense especially when you've come, as our MC has said, you've had several hours of being into the aircraft. You land and then you just don't want to wait for your luggage. There you have now the option of Airport Mtani. Because of them, Jomo Kenyatta will be able now to offer that premier service. This is a time we need to stop digging, and we have stopped digging. Giving his keynote address, Kenya Airports Authority Chairman Caleb Kusitani also lauded the idea, stating this will come in handy as the authority plans on expanding Jomo Kenyatta International Airport. We run about 22 airports in this country. We have plans to build a new terminal here, which will be a state of the art. This airport you see is a 1978 architecture designed for 2 million passengers. Currently, it is having 10 million passengers. He came up with an idea that will help us improve services at the airport, and it will create employment, and it will make us create revenue for us at, uh, as KAA. This is a Kenyan-driven uh, initiative. We pray that you expand to the other East African countries and uh, get the support of all the other uh, people that you will need. Other services that travelers can look forward to include luggage storage as well as lost luggage retrieval. Yeah, this is the first uh, of this service at JKIA. Actually, not JKIA, only even in East Africa. The other service that I know exists like this is in Johannesburg and uh, Cairo in Egypt. The current traveler right now wants convenience. Even you in your t at your home and you're traveling with, I uh, imagine, uh, with family and you're arriving here with big bags of, of coming from your trip, you'd want that person to, that company to assist you with your luggage. So it's a convenience that's greatly needed. So it's a work of everybody that we make a shout of it and let people know it exists. For Chums Media, my name is Michael Zimanjay.